When I heard that a second edition was to be, was being organized, I was quite pleasantly surprised. And uh, I'm quite sure, uh, looking to the grit and resolve of the organizers, that there would be many more editions uh, in, in future. The purists, the purists should think that it is too much of a fusion kind of an activity, it's a, though it is a, named as a, a lit fest, a literary festival, it's a, it uh, brings in Mr. Ram Jetmalani, it brings in uh, film stars. In t but then we shouldn't really be stuck up with the, uh, the notion of uh, purity, which, uh, beca because these are the times when you would have to uh, really showcase uh, things in the manner uh, the people would accept it. In the 60s and 70s, I grew up in Bhubaneswar as a student, uh, Katakanda Bhubaneswar as a student, and I recall in those days, apart from the Lingaraj temple and other uh, monuments of uh, excellence in Bhubaneswar, the, uh, where Gopinath Mahanti stayed, or Ramakantarath, or Sachi Rautra in Katak, or Surendra Mahanti, uh, Mr. Manoj Das, Professor Chandrasekhar Rath, let uh, Krishna Prasad Misra, our teacher. We knew all of them, where they lived. And in fact, for students, the temples of Bhubaneswar are as much a destination as for many of us, the houses of these uh, people. They were part of the life of uh, both uh, the people of Bhubaneswar and Odisha. Uh, in the last 30, 40, 50 years, things have changed so much. Uh, most of uh, art and literature is now pursued as some kind of a niche activity. It was, of course, a niche activity at all times, but uh, it has become, it is becoming more and more a niche activity. The marginalization of the arts and literature uh, by a highly commercial and uh, kind of a crass uh, kind of a society uh, is manifest in the grossness of our uh, conduct. You. Uh, wake up in the morning on the newspaper pages, in the evening uh, you switch on the television channels, you, the discourse in the drawing rooms or in the public space, everywhere uh, it, it, is, it seems as if the whole society is now bereft of any depth and seriousness. I mean only when you come here that you hear somebody like Padma Vibhushan Sri Mahapatra speak about uh, Konark and the humble way that the artists still continue to, uh, to honor that legacy and uh, recreate that legacy. Uh, so, uh, the depth and some kind of seriousness which should permeate the uh, society if it has to uh, it, it endure, uh, it, it is uh, getting rubbed of that because of this crassness. So, a literary festival of this kind, uh, even for a period of only two days, places some of these people in this, at the center stage and, uh, and demonstrates to us that there is much beyond uh, in life than uh, what, we, what we are confronted every day. There is, there is still some space for silence and solitude uh, in the cacophony of the glitchy, absolutely flashy kind of a world in which we are increasingly living.